Hello, Aries. This is an ex friend to see if your ex is likely to come back, okay? This is for Aries, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, and Jupiter signs, guys. If you like this video, please give it a thumbs up, share the video, and subscribe. All right. Here we go. Aries, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, and Jupiter signs. Is it likely that you, you and your ex will reunite? This reading is a general, so of course it's not going to resonate for everyone. So take what resonates and leave the rest behind. Okay, guys, here we go. All right, Aries. You. Your ex. Ooh, okay. What you want. What they want. What you need. What they need. Is there anyone involved? And is it likely? All right, guys. What you need, Aries, is to decide either between two people or is either you deciding yourself. It has only, you know, to do with one person, but you deciding yourself between yourself and that person. Okay? So that that is where you are I don't know if I said this what you need but I, that's where you are right now it's either two people that you are deciding between you know who is good for you or you're deciding between yourself and another individual here basically whether or not you want to really be in a relationship okay also for some of you I feel like you're deciding whether you really want a sexual relationship like you want to have passion in a relationship or you want a, a true commitment that is built on something more stable than that is what I'm getting for some of you as well okay for the other person what they want basically is is their queen or their king they want somebody that they feel like um, why do I keep saying what they want because maybe that's exactly what it is that that's not them that is indeed what they want but I feel like they are needing to decide that that is indeed what they want don't just think about it you need to be about it and I think that is where this person is they also need to have the confidence to come towards you or be who they need to be like stand in their power you know a lot of times I told people the the Empress is like the magician for me it's a physicality you know it's it's putting your intentions out there it is doing things to raise your vibration it is getting your money right it is getting your head right it is getting your heart right you know so that you can you can be who you can be proud of in a relationship okay so that's where I feel like this person is I feel like they're getting their shit together honestly and I feel like they're getting their shit together with you in mind all right what you want is to be able to take a leap of faith because you know I think that in the past you chose other things other than yourself and I feel like you know it's hard for you at this point because you have gotten so strong that you've already always been strong let me rephrase that okay in the past there was something that knocked you out of your element okay now you are back where you need to be and I feel like you are trying to not let anybody affect that again at this point so even though you feel this strong pull towards somebody I feel like it's taken a lot out of you to you know put yourself in a situation to be vulnerable is what I feel what they want is to come towards you but they want the confidence I feel like because to me air not air but fire is having the confidence to move how you want to move not just think about it not just dream about it but to do it that is what I feel okay and what you need 
is to realize that there is something that is very important that you need to see here. Look past the hurt. Look past the, the deception that you felt in the past. Look past that ten of swords moment when you just felt bogged down, beat down, betrayed. Because there's something very substantial here. Okay? Something very substantial here. Okay? What they need. They need to balance out that fire and water energy. All right? They need to take action. They can feel all day long, like I said, but they need to take action. They need to move towards you. They need to act like they're passionate about you because, see, we like passion. We like action. Okay? Don't think about it. Don't talk about it. We need for you to be about it. Okay? That's what we do as Aries. All right. So is there anyone else involved? <laughs> of course. Of course. You. You being your strong self. And I feel like that is really what's getting in the way here. That's what's getting in the way. That's what's intimidating to, to people a lot of the times. It's just how very strong that you are. I don't feel like this is another person, you know, aside from this person over here. No, I feel like this is you. I think you're all about, you know, keeping yourself informed. Not letting anybody else get you out of whack is what I feel. No, nobody else is involved for them. I feel like they're all caught up in their head over you. It's just the way I feel, quite honestly. Could be a Gemini that is significant in your reading. Um, that's about all that I see. Sagittarius, possibly. Okay. And let's see. Could be any other sign, guys. Let me put that out there. But that's just the energy that I feel strongly. All right. So is it possible? Likely? Most definitely. Most definitely. But I, I get the feeling that somebody needs to see you showing up more. I feel like they need to see that, you know, you really are in it. You really are in it to win it. They need to see that you care about them. They need to feel that. Okay, so even though we are this these strong Aryans, you know, sometimes we can come across not really non-caring, but nonchalant, like we don't give up, you know. So I think that's probably what um, is between you, okay? Don't feel like this is a breakup. I feel like you guys are just getting into something for a lot of you for a lot of you but keep this in mind as well that I also feel like there is somebody lingering on the outskirts that you are not with that's still in your energy I feel that strongly all right Aries so that is what I have for um, you guys for I think it's the 19th through I need to look let me see <clears throat> Now, for the 20th through the 26th. All right, guys. So I'll be speaking with you soon. Bye now.